West Princess Street, in the Woodlands area of Glasgow, is known for its diverse community and Victorian sandstone tenement buildings. In the 1970s, one of these tenements burnt down, and for almost 40 years the site was left derelict. There are spaces like this all over Glasgow, often used as dumping grounds for local waste. But look at it now, the community have come together and turned this urban wasteland into a thriving garden. And that's not all. I'm going to go find out what's going on at the Woodlands Community Garden. Funded by the Climate Challenge Fund until March 2011, the Woodlands Community Development Trust, who part own the land, have made their key aim to involve locals in the garden's development. The community have um, accepted it very well. Um, we have, we've had tons of folk locals get involved. Um, the first few clear up days, we had 50, 60 people coming. Um, just desperate, I think, to change what was quite an ugly sight. The number of people involved has been quite amazing. Uh, we need to do more than that, I think. Uh, Again, at this stage with the garden, I think people still feel a bit what's actually happening. It's not looking like a traditional garden. Another objective of the Trust is the growing of organic vegetables as part of their commitment to the environmental education of the community. But that doesn't only involve gardening. Ongoing at the moment, we have the building of the Energy Awareness Hub, which is going to be a building that's made from recycled materials. The Energy Awareness Hub um, is, I think, probably the main reason we've got the funding, to be honest, because it's such a major part of the Climate Challenge Fund and just that idea of how do we change our behaviours to try and reduce our impact on the planet. It will also be a social space uh, to just kind of hang out and kind of spend some time with each other. One of the outcomes for the garden um, has been a really nice mixture of people coming down and um, there's been lots of people of different ages, different backgrounds, and they all they use this as a kind of central point um, to gather, um, which was kind of its intention. The garden has attracted a wide range of different people who come down for many different reasons. A perfect example of transforming an urban wasteland into an inviting social space. I think it's just a great way to meet people who are like-minded. Two weeks ago I got made redundant, so I now have more time on my hands and I uh, wanted to come down and get involved with the local community. And hopefully more people get interested and begin to grow their own food, which I think every, like, should, be a, should be common knowledge for everybody.